The 2018 Sakharov Prize winner, former prisoner of the Kremlin Ole Sentsov, received his award in Strasbourg on November 26. The European Parliament declared the Ukrainian film director the laureate of the award on October 25, 2018. A year ago, he was unable to accept the award personally, since he was imprisoned in Russia. His sister, Natalia Kaplan, and lawyer Dmitry Dinze received the award on his behalf. At the presentation ceremony, calls to release political prisoners from Russian captivity were made repeatedly. Today, there was applause. Slava Ukraine! The award was presented to Sensov by the President of the European Parliament, David Sassoli. On September 7th, the day Ole Sensov returned home from Russian prison, Sassoli tweeted that he hoped to present the award personally. It's a great honor for me to welcome Ole Sensov here. He returned to Ukraine after five years in prison on charges of terrorism. Last year, he was in prison in Siberia. Many of you remember the empty space at the ceremony. This empty place was a symbol of his struggle for democracy. I would like to pay tribute to you for your courage, determination, and sense of honor. In his speech, Sensov made calls not to trust Putin and to remember all those Ukrainians who are still illegally detained in Russian prisons. Every time one of you thinks about how to extend a hand of friendship to Putin over our heads, remember about each of the 13,000 people who are killed in Ukraine about those hundreds of guys who are still in prisons, whom they might be torturing right now, about those Crimean Tatars who could be arrested at any moment. Remember about those guys who are in camouflage right now, who are in trenches, who risk their lives for our and for your freedom. The award, named after Soviet physicist and human rights activist Andrei Zakharov, was founded by the European Parliament in 1988. Since then, it has been awarded annually to those who defend human rights. Its laureates at different times included Nelson Mandela and the United Nations. And now Ole Sansov became the first Ukrainian to receive the prize. Reported by Ina Kusinska for UATV.